Indiana State House Representatives Johanna King, Matt Lehman, David Abbott, and Timothy Wesco. Johanna King sponsored this bill, and this bill is HB 1062. I'm going to read it to you. House Bill Number 1062, a bill for an act to amend Indiana Code concerning labor and safety. A minor less than 14 years of age may not be employed or allowed to work in any gainful occupation except as a former domestic service worker, caddy for persons playing the game of golf or newspaper carrier, and 12 years of age may not be permitted to work at farm labor except as a farm operator by the minor's parents. It keeps going. An exempted minor who is at least 14 years of age and less than 18 years of age may work at farm labor during school hours on a school day. It gets better. An exempted minor who is at least 14 years of age and less than 16 years of age may work during school hours on a school day. This subsection does not apply to an exempted minor who works at farm labor as described in section 14.5 of this chapter. An exempted minor describes in subsection A may not work as follows. Before 7 a.m. or 7 p.m., however, or except, and you can read all the other good stuff. These people are saying that a child with the ages that I just read to you can quit school and work on someone else's farm during school hours with the parent's permission. A 12-year-old is like 8th grade. 14, you may be anywhere from 8th to ninth or 10th grade, depending on what state you're in and when the kids started school. Why are they trying to get 12-year-olds, 13, 14, young kids to work? Now, if you're under 12, you can work on a parent's farm. But if you're over 14 and you've passed the 8th grade, you can go work on someone else's farm during school hours. And it, it goes further and it talks about 16, but no older than 18, when and where they can work during school hours. They want these kids, if these kids decide to drop out, where are the parents? They're saying, hey, if your kid is tired of school, sign a waiver and let them work on somebody's farm. What does that sound like to you? I failed to mention that they were all Republicans. And I think they want to take they're so conservative. They're so wanting to make America great again that they're trying to take us back to when Abraham Lincoln's father sold him out or hired him out to another farmer while he collected profits and Abraham Lincoln worked. What do you think?